Okay guys, so this is my little Bath & Body Works collection. I'm just going to run through the scents that I currently have in my Bath & Body Works collection. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the video. So here we go. This one is Sweet Petal Pound Cake, one of my favorite scents. And then we have Pink Velvet Cupcake. Uh, this scent is very berry like and it smells so much like the um, Charcoal Berry Kool Aid. This is also one of my favorites again Twisted Peppermint, very, very Christmassy. And it smells exactly like the peppermint, like candy canes. And then this one is Sunset Glow. Look at the packaging, guys. Come on. I had to have this in my collection. Smells really, really nice. And the cherry scent in it is very, very prominent. So it's about, it smells very, very cherry-like. Um, also gives me like Kool-Aid vibes. And then this one is very yogurty. This one is fruity sherbet and i love this scent as well i just got this one is one of my most recent scents this one is hello beautiful this is the ideal spring scent and i love it and then this one is also a new one this is like a cotton candy vibe it gives cotton candy but also like berry vibes and i personally love that about this scent then this one is an oldie but a goodie. This one is basically so similar to At The Beach, but it has like the ripe guava scent in it that makes it a little different and very unique. This is a must have in any girly girl collection. Then of course, everybody knows strawberry pound cake. Everybody knows strawberry pound cake. Everybody loves strawberry pound cake. Um, I'm switching the setting, guys, to see, like, which one is best. Um, this is just the ideal gourmand scent. So if you're a gourmand girl, you have to have this in your collection. Then I have one of the ones I love the most. Like, you can see that big dent in my bottle. Um, I will be getting another one of this um, specific scent. You're the one. You're the one is literally the one, okay? It's one of the best floral scents. I love this scent so much. Like, I legit fell in love with this specific rose scent. I'm not really a rose girly, but this scent and Pure Wonder is one of the best uh, rosy floral scents. But I only have this one in my collection. And then we're going to move on to over here. This one is Japanese Cherry Blossom. Uh, this is always giving me like rich vibes, um, but like mature rich vibes. I wouldn't say necessarily like a grandma, but like even if it's a grandma scent, it's like more like a rich grandma scent. <laughs> I don't know why I said that, but it is like a very like mature scent. It's a mature floral. So if you're into that, you definitely have to get Japanese cherry blossom in your collection. It's also like one of the OG scents from Bath & Body Works. So it's just... You know, it's just like one of those scents you have to get. Then a love. Love was from one of the Christmas collections with love, peace, and joy. I really, really want to get joy, guys, but I only have love from that collection. And the love is the best. Like, I'm in love with love. Like, cotton candy scents. Anything gourmand, anything sweet, it really has my heart. And this scent really, 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 really got something done on me, guys. Like, I really, really love this scent a lot. Very sweet, very cotton candy. And then this is one of the newer scents from Bath & Body Works. This one is Luminous. Luminous is the ideal rich chick scent, okay? As you can see, look at the cap of it. Like, it's just so royal, and I think this was from the later part of 2023. They came up with this scent. I wore this scent last night to bed. And I'm telling you guys, 
I literally woke up this morning and I was smelling the scent still like it's a very long lasting it's very strong it's very potent if you wear it someone will ask you what you're wearing okay um the bottle also is just very textured and nice I don't hear literally has like a texture and it's just very very royal like you can literally see a difference between it and like all the other scents so you have to have that in your collection then this one is raspberry jam donut for all my gourmand girlies this is something you need like raspberry jam donuts is one of the best alongside with um strawberry pound cake raspberry jam donuts is one of the best gourmand scents okay so you have to get this one for your collection personally love it so much now we're on to the second row we're going to start with fall in bloom fall in bloom is definitely like a fall scent it literally has like this very sophisticated leafy scent i don't know like they elevated a leaf scent and put it in a bottle so it's like very leafy you smell a lot of greens in it but it definitely has like the essence of fall in it and how am i going to explain this it literally smells like a leaf but a fragrant leaf so you definitely still smell the leaf scent but it was though like a leaf was like a blossomed like a flower and that's like what they captured in a bottle really really love this scent very unique so i definitely want to keep that in my collection and then another scent i love this is one of my newer scents i got this within like the christmas period this one is called jolly gingerbread village this is a gingerbread scent but they elevated this scent a lot as well okay guys it's literally like a gingerbread but it's a very 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 strong scent i literally wore this scent i literally wore this scent oh my gosh guys i wish you guys could smell this but it literally smells like gingerbread especially on the dry down but it's just very very long lasting like i personally love love this scent i got this one on my birthday last year and this is just Christmas cookies. I like it. I mean, it's not one of my favorite scents. Got this as a gift from my sister. I don't necessarily love, love this scent, but it is very girly, very gourmand. So it's something to have. And then this is coconut cream pie. I love coconut cream pie because it's a very creamy. You can definitely smell the cream pie. You can smell the coconut cream pie immediately. But this specific one has a lot of caramel in it. Like you can legit smell the caramel in it. So it's a little bit more caramelly than the, the previous packaging, packaging um, coconut cream pie scents from Bath & Body Works. Then I have this one. This one is called Snowflakes and Cashmere. And this is a very sophisticated scent. Um, it reminds me a lot of material of a sweater, but a sweater with like a very expensive perfume in it. That's how it smells. It gives me a very comforting kind of vibe, like something very homey, but it's very strong. I think the vanilla in it is very high as well. And it does have like that hint of caramel in it that brings it off very, very well. One of my favorite scents, guys. And this is a must have in your fragrance collection as well. Dahlia is one of the best scents. It is a dupe to good girl, but a more fruity dupe to good girl. It also reminds me a lot of this scent that I went through before. But this one is like the older, more sophisticated sister. And this one is like the sweetie, more fruity, younger sister. So they're very close, but they're different. And then pretty as a peach is just like the epitome of a girly scent. This is one of my favorite scents for so many reasons, guys. And it's because it really, really reminds me of my childhood when I used to use like the little robots in class. That scent is literally trapped in this bottle. I don't know why, but it brings me back to using those little rubbers that used to have like the citric shapes, um, whether it be the orange or the lemon, and you rub it and you'd have like that sweet smell, that, that unique smell. That's how this um, Pretty as a Peach smells. And then, of course, I had to have some fall scent. This one is a very pumpkin-y scent. 
very pumpkin-y scent. Um, this is marshmallow pumpkin latte. I'm not really smelling a lot of the marshmallow in this scent to be honest, but I am smelling the pumpkin over everything. Let me go ahead and spray it on the other hand, just to kind, just to kind of, just to kind of like remember exactly how it smells. Cause I don't really, well, this scent is mostly pumpkin. Like I can definitely smell like the latte vibe. But it's mostly pumpkin-y. Um, it's one of the scents I would say is just an OG scent. And if you really, really want any form of pumpkin fall scent in your collection, you could definitely cap that one. Um, this one is called Sunshine Mimosa. I don't have a lot of citric scents. So I really, really wanted to get this citric scent in specific in my collection. <clears throat> because it's literally so orangey like you can literally smell like the tangerine in it i really really love it um it just says fresh citrus but it kind of um reminds me more of tangerine than an orange or a lemon it's very tangerine -y. um then this scent is fairy tale i did scratch my bottle a little bit because i brought this to practicum when i was working um at this school and unfortunately i had my nail file in my bag and it got scratched up but yeah this is one of my favorite scents as well it's also very very like mystical and cute like i love this scent a lot like it's one of the prettiest packagings i have but i kind of scraped it up but yeah guys this scent is very vanilla -y, very cute very girly and you can't really go wrong with fairy tale all right, so this one is Vanilla Bean Noel, one of my favorite Christmas scents. This one smells exactly like dough, like this one smells just like dough, like cookie dough. Like immediately after spelling it, that's what you will like think about, like cookie dough. Really, really love this one um, as well. Now, Bonfire Bash is the ideal vanilla scent. This is the scent I've used the most i don't know you guys can't really see it but this one has like the biggest dent in it and it's because i've always been in love with bonfire bash and this i think is the newest packaging i'm not sure though but this one is really really good it reminds me so much of like s'mores it gives a s'mores vibe and that's why i personally love bonfire bash because it's very unique it's an old scent that bath and body works keeps bringing back and they bring it back because it's amazing then this is one of the strongest scents that i have ever smelled in my entire life like this is a perfume in a spray bottle okay this one is ballet night very strong okay if you don't get anything i said tonight today in this in your collection ballet nights i said ballet ballet nights are literally is literally like the best scent um it does remind me of a scent that um i smelled before but i can't remember what scent it is exactly uh but this is like the best scent okay like one of the strongest bath and body work scents i've ever owned really really amazing scent then this is another fall scent that I like. It's not as pumpkin-y as I would like though. Um, it's very nice. I think it brings like a very, how would I say it, a light vibe to what um, marshmallow pumpkin latte brings. It brings a lighter form of all. Mm. It's very cinnamony and like vanilla -y, but it's 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 lighter. I don't know if because I had it for a while, but let me spray it on the back of my hand. Okay. Okay. It smells really, really good. It's mm-hmm. Okay. I think I really love that scent actually. It's not as light, but it smells better on the dry down like immediately after smelling it you wouldn't necessarily love it 
and you definitely need to pair it with other things for it to like be really really strong but yeah this is an oldie as well at the beach at the beach is an old scent everybody knows it everybody loves it you just have to have it in your collection oldie and a goodie and then we have blueberry sugar pancakes this is also one of my favorites i love blueberry sugar pancakes just a very unique scent it smells exactly like its name so you can't really get this anywhere else you just have to get this specific scent so you can actually capture that blueberry sugar pancake um fragrant so okay so this one is gingham this is also a very unique scent as well it's very fresh very clean very strong so you know it's the my favorite like it's the best fresh scent um but it's also like a very strong fresh scent like you literally will walk around smelling like you know expensive laundry <laughs> and then this one is open sky this literally is like the it literally they literally captured fresh air and vanilla in a bottle that's how i can explain this specific scent love this scent and then this one here is cotton candy clothes it's a very light very cotton candy scent um it's one of my favorites as well so you can't really go wrong with that especially if you're pairing it with other cotton candy scents this one is fireside flores one of my favorites as well i got it from the same collection um i got my twisted peppermint from and i think they have some new packaging for both of them but i really just can't get over fast i very very marshmallowy it reminds me of my body ecology scent sweet love just really really amazing then i have winter berry wonder this scent for anybody that loves berry this is the best berry scent you could possibly have in your collection it's just really berry like and it has like this really sweet unique scent i can't personally like explain but if you're a berry lover this is a berry scent you must have in your collection then of course this is very perfumey ginghams are always blessing anything gingham is always blessing so let me turn this down to see if you guys can see the label better yeah but this is gingham vibrant it's very very loud i don't know why they didn't put the scent notes on it so i can't really tell you exactly what's in it but i can tell you it's very berry like it's very berry like and it's not like that cool sweet berry like this it's more like a rich fragrant berry like a perfume berry and then this one is a butterfly this scent is vanilla and raspberry so it's a mix of both vanilla and raspberry and i love it then this is also a very unique strong scent this one is dream bright everybody loves dream bright because it's just so expensive smelling i love it so much just an ideal scent to have and then Coco Paradise is one that came out in 2023, I think. And yeah, it just smells like expensive sunscreen. So it's a very unique as well, something to have in your collection. Then Into the Night is also an oldie and a goodie. Very, very, very nice perfume. I would literally call it a perfume because the musk in it, oh my gosh, the patchouli in it, amazing. And then I finished a bottle of this because I actually got another bottle from my brother and I'm on this one already. But I finished an entire bottle of whipped rose and vanilla and I love this scent a lot. And then finally, I have champagne toast but in the shimmer mist. And of course, it smells very fruity like the actual scent and I just love it so much. So guys, that is the end of my collection. I hope you guys did enjoy and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.